Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines. It's two weeks to competition and the Terps racing team has turned this off-campus parking lot into a test track. A lot of design work and preparation and a lot of man hours in the actual building of the car. They look like a professional pit crew preparing for the Grand Prix. Next month, these engineering students will race a Formula One style car they designed and built. Driver Alexander Fillier. It handles just fine and uh, look to be pretty competitive in competition. The University of Maryland is considered an elite racing school, but after a less than stellar performance last year, team members say they have a lot to prove. It's been a really big effort this year because it didn't really want, run very well last year. So we've done a lot of work getting it to start well and run well. To win, the car must be the best on and off the track. The endurance is the height of competition, which is about 20 half mile laps of the car. Uh, and then there's also um, static events. So we'll have to defend the design of the car to judges that are professionals in the industry. With the morning test run complete, it's back to the lab where students will use the data they collected this morning to make tweaks before the big competition. Strip the car down to the bare frame, um, repaint everything, make sure nothing has been failing since we've been running. Win or lose, team members say it's a love of the sport that drives them. Once I get into racing, you can't get out of it. In College Park, Rochelle Metzger, CTV News.